Hey guys, it's Lester from Game Case. Today I'm going to show you how to get online on 3.55 on your custom firmware PS3 uh, using GeoHot, Queemy, or with Tango. Um, I'm going to put together a f mega upload file for you, give you the link. Uh, basically, it's just a spoofer, a Blu ray fixture, and a multi man package that works with a spoofer. All the credits go to rebug.me because they made this package uh, version spoofer. I just put all these together for you just to help. This hides your games online, your jailbroken games, so it, you can't get caught, but you can't get caught anyway. It's just uh, extra security. Uh, once you get this file, just extract it all. And you come out with a shitload of files. Uh, that's GeoHots. That's if you're using the GeoHot for the spoofer, and that's for Retango and Queem. Same goes for everything else. That's Retango, that's Queem and GeoHot, and that's Queem and that's Retango. So I'm using Queem at the moment. So I'll just get all these files here. Uh, Um, obviously you're going to need a pen drive plugged in, just copy all your files and put them on your pen drive. I have them all here but <laughs> once you've done that uh, your pen drive should look similar to mine. And if you're using Queem, obviously it should look exactly the same. Uh, once you've done that, you just need to go on to your PS3. Um, I'm the spoofer doesn't change any of your certificates, so you can't get banned just for anyone that's scared of doing it. And uh, we'll just head over to PS3 here, and I'll choose what to do. Hey guys, now we're on the PS3. You can see that I. I'm not signed in. Um, first, you need to go to install package files, and you'll see these three files. Install the spoofer, then multi man, then the Blu ray fix in that order. Because if you install the fix before multi man, it will break multi man because it'll not patch it, and then you'll just be getting caught. Once all these are installed, you'll have the 3.60 version spoofer and Multiman. Just go into the spoofer and it'll come up with a red screen, some yellow writing in the top left hand corner. As you can see, it says cross to install 3.60 version spoof and circle to uninstall. Uninstall is if you ever want to on spoof it so you can update or whatever if a new custom firmware comes out just press X it will look like it's frozen but it's not actually just give it a bit and then it will just come up and say that it's successful zoom in here You probably can't see that, but it says successful 3.60 spoof install complete, reboot. So turn off your system, turn it back on, and if you go to system settings, it'll say you're on 3.60 when really you're on 3.55 as all your jailbreak stuff still works. Uh, that's just a DNS or I my internet's crap, so I usually have to try a few times to get in. But hopefully, 
Alright, uh, there you go, as you can see, current management and our friends are loading up. Ball your games will work. Jailbroken games or not. So, hope this helps, guys. Please subscribe. Bye.